Hey everybody, what's going on? Josh here with Scrapyard Films, and today I got another Vegas Pro 18 tutorial for you. And today we're gonna be going over the new Style Transfer plugin. And just in case you didn't know, Vegas Pro is included in Vegas Post, which is a post-production software suite that includes Vegas Pro, Vegas Effects, and Vegas Image. All the affiliate links and information will be posted in the description below, so let's go ahead and jump right into Vegas. All right, so we're in Vegas 18. Now I've dragged and dropped a clip of me, just a corrected clip, not graded or anything, onto the timeline. And if you wanna add style transfer to it, you go over to video effects, go up to the search, type STY, and we'll see style transfer be filtered out. And from here, I'm gonna open this up a little bit, and we'll see a bunch of cool little presets. Now if you use style transfer, you're basically gonna be converting your video to some sort of like painting almost. It uses AI or artificial intelligence with Vegas's deep learning to intelligently render a crazy awesome looking effect. So I'm gonna drag and drop just one random one on here. And the style that I chose was the Weeping Woman, which is a Picasso style painting. Now the only things you see in Style Transfer are the styles. You can click that and drop and select whichever one you want. And then you have the detail of your style from low to original. Low is the lowest quality, medium quality, high quality, and then pristine original quality. Now we're currently on low, and that took maybe one second to process. If we click medium, that took about two seconds to process. If we click high, that took about six seconds to process, and we choose original. That took a minute to process that one frame. So, style transfer, what I personally use it for is taking crazy cool screenshots. If you expect to render something using style transfer, I would not render it using the original detail or else you're gonna be sitting for hours. Multiply each frame by about a minute or longer and then that's how long it's gonna take, which is crazy amounts of time. So you can go down to like, you know, let's say medium or high and then produce some pretty cool things. So let's go ahead and go through a few of them. This is the original one, Self-Portrait by Picasso. Then we got Night Alley Walk. And then we got The Great Wave. And then we got Fruit Hunt. And then we have Light. And then we have Small World One. And then we got Floral Pattern. Sunrise Flowers. Abstract Painting. Black and White. The Starry Night. The Pandorica Opens. The Weeping Woman. Bark Pattern. Font Pattern. Leaf pattern, and last but not least, good old Rick and Morty. So yeah, if you put their detail on maybe low, medium, or high, you can render a video to look pretty good, and it won't take too, too long, but if you wanna take a really cool, awesome screenshot, then go ahead and drop it down to original, wait your minute or two for it to process that one frame, and then take a screenshot, and then you're good to go. But that concludes the wrap up of Style Transfer. And there you have it. If this tutorial helped you out, be sure to shoot a like and subscribe down there because that'll really help me out. And if you want to support the channel through Patreon, you can do that as well. I have a link in the description below. So thanks again for watching, everybody, and I'll see you all in the next video. And I want to give a special shout out to all of my super subscribers up there at the top. Be sure to check out their channels for some awesome content.